guys and welcome back this is the coffee with jay i hope you guys are doing great so just as we saw michelle's relationship drama unfold right before our eyes we thought that maybe things had cooled off but it seems like we had just started so in the morning michelle posted a number on her instagram as curious as people were they headed over to true color to see who the number belonged to and alas it belongs to leroy sidambe himself now just as when we thought okay what was that as petty as it is now we hear that michelle could be dating zimbabwean millionaire scott even though scott has denied the allegations and said that he does not know of this person we know that scott is definitely a bag he's a millionaire who's been linked with the gold mafia now leroy has something to say mama k they have tried but if there is one thing i will never ever dream of any other re partner besides you they are celebrating let them i love you and only you deeply sorry for humiliating you love i don't even know you girl when you get to dubai today you will meet her i love and love only you again can we also be allowed to have fun without being judged friends there is a possible marriage here mara scott nawe asiba nyese boti now obviously here he was addressing michelle the question is why would you have to post this on instagram Leroy, you could have easily just taken your phone and sent Michali this message direct. I mean, it's clearly directed to Michali, so it could have went straight into Michali's DMs. Uh, just not your Instagram stories, so just that on its own definitely looks fishy. Anyway, Michali has something to say about this. All she had to say to shut this whole thing down was Uti Nimangelo. With the laughing emoji at this rate leroy is definitely making himself a laughing stock because michelle has already said that they broke up in october so this is definitely making himself look like a fool i don't know what he's drinking or what he's smoking over there in dubai but honestly if he let his friend melusi say that about his woman then clearly something is wrong here so clearly something is off okay we can clearly see that at this point you guys i have secondhand embarrassment for leroy for trying to contain the situation because it has already gone bad at this point there is absolutely nothing he can do or say meanwhile his ex-wife mary jane sidambe is living it up in dubai exactly where he is maybe he should think about hitting her up and maybe apologizing and saying this was all a huge mistake because at this rate there's nothing more that can be done let me know what you think about this whole drama down in the comment section thank you so much for watching